An Eastern Carolina baseball stadium could soon get some upgrades if they are approved by city officials. Stephen Glover is in Kinston, where he spoke with the Parks and Recreation Director about what will be discussed at tonight's city council meeting. Stephen. Courtney, Granger Stadium has seen some changes within the last few months, with the Wood Ducks leaving to the Bird Dogs taking its place, and now it could see a new scoreboard in its horizon. This old scoreboard that's well past its prime is like a relic to the stadium. The current scoreboard has been here since 2005, so it's almost 20 years old. Um, it is it is lived well past its lifespan, uh, according to Dactronics, so it's uh, it, it served us well. But it could soon be retired, depending on the outcome from tonight's Kinson City Council meeting. The Granger Stadium, now home to the Down East Bird Dogs, may see some changes, including a new scoreboard. In addition, fans will love and an upgrade the stadium needs, says Kinson Lenore County Parks and Recreation Director Scott Alston. It, it, it potentially would be be very attractive. It'll 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 do all the modern amenities, uh, replays, um, and the sound would be would be exquisite. On that. The potential new scoreboard will provide better viewing position, modern upgrades as seen at other stadiums, and an overall upgraded experience for events the stadium holds, such as movies in the park. Down East Bird Dog General Manager Sherry Massengill says she's excited and hopeful for what's to come. Any and all improvements are always, you know, welcome and always appreciated. I know that the city of Kinston has just done a great job over the years. Massengill has ambition for a home run decision with Tuesday's night's city council meeting for a community that loves baseball. I'm hoping that it's a yes and we're getting a new scoreboard and video board for the 25 season. If approved by city council, the new scoreboard will be in the ballpark price range between $500,000 to $675,000. Reporting live in Kinston, Stephen Glover, WITN News. All right, thanks, Stephen. And the Kinston City Council meeting will make the decision on replacing the scoreboard tonight at 7, and we'll have details on that meeting coming up tonight at 11.